The container. It was the prerequisite for Hamburg's continuing success as a key hub in global trade. Since 1968, it has changed the port more than any technology that came before it. For 50 years. It was 50 years ago that the first container ship was processed in the port of Hamburg. That was the starting gun for a whole new era. And today we're going back in time. 50 years of containers in the port of Hamburg. It's the 31st of May 1968. The American Lancer docks at the Burchard Kai. She's the first pure container ship to enter the port of Hamburg. Initially, people don't know what to make of this strange new box. When it first arrived, they were all a bit surprised, wondering what these boxes were about. But many people thought it was a good idea. But people thought it would serve just some markets like the USA and Japan and the big ports. They didn't expect it to be used the world over as it is today. About two-thirds of the business done in the port of Hamburg involves the container. Between eight and nine million of them are processed in Hamburg every year. The container's success is based on a very simple idea. A container is basically nothing more than a transport box. I open it up and put my goods into it, secure them, and that stops them being stolen and protects them from the weather. You shut the door, seal it, and great, you can put it anywhere. Road, rail, ship. It's a standardized transport box. It's so simple, but has achieved so much. And it's established itself over the years. We can't imagine life without it now. You can still experience the history of the container today at the Hamburg Port Museum. Here too, you get the sense that the introduction of a standardized container was a historic change for the shipping industry. It meant that the port's entire infrastructure changed. It was a big investment for the terminal operators. They had just rebuilt the port and made it the way it was before the war, and suddenly that was no longer up to date. People weren't sure whether the investment was worth it. In that regard, other ports were quicker than Hamburg. And people didn't think it would take on the proportions that it has. The container ships back then were only as big as the feeder ships today. And people would never have dreamt of the size container ships are today. A loading capacity of over 20,000 TEU was unthinkable 50 years ago. It seemed clear today that going forward, the container will remain the standard. So to summarize, what does the container mean in three simple words? Well, it's a safe unit of transport, it protects the goods. It's effective and it makes handling cheap. And the port of Hamburg without the container is unimaginable. That's right, it's here to stay. We couldn't do without it. Great, 50 years of containers in the port of Hamburg. That was our smart port special. And so, as always at this point, as we say in Hamburg, choose. That's right. Bye.